Hi guys, uh, Marcel here. It is Tuesday afternoon and I am hopping on here real quick to say hi and to share how excited I was this morning when I got up, you know, pretty early. I get up around 5.30, 6 a.m., uh, get my cup of coffee, I open my laptop and check my online, you know, stuff. And I realized I had 300 subscribers on my YouTube channel as of early this morning. And I was so excited, you guys, so excited to have reached that number. I uh, just wanted to say thank you to those of you who have subscribed. Um, thank you to those of you who come back and watch me, even if you're not subscribed. And I wanted to hop on here and share kind of a Taco Tuesday celebration uh, recipe with you. And so today we are talking taco seasoning. This is my homemade Tex-Mex taco seasoning. This is a seasoning mixture. I literally use this every single week. And I make a batch of uh, two pounds of ground meat on Sunday, and season it with this very mixture, and kind of keep it around all week for my kids. Um, my kids like to have tacos as like a, a warm after school snack. Um, I use lean turkey, so it's like just a protein a protein filled good snack for them until I get dinner ready and this is the seasoning mix I use. Um, I used to buy those packets all the time. I know you know the ones I'm talking about and ultimately they just weren't my favorite. I mean there's nothing wrong with them but the full flavor ones were too salty and so then I tried the lower sodium version and they were too garlicky and so I just decided to do it myself and it's taken me, it took me uh, a few times to get the balance of this just right, um, but once I got it right uh, for our taste buds, I've never looked back, and I use this combination every week. I have yet to get complaints, and so let's go ahead and have a look down here, and I'm going to share with you all the spices I put in our homemade Tex-Mex taco seasoning. All right, guys, well, here it is. Here are the six little spices I use to make our homemade Tex-Mex taco seasoning. Uh, we've got two teaspoons of ancho chili powder, a quarter teaspoon of garlic powder, a full teaspoon of onion powder, a teaspoon of black pepper, full teaspoon of salt, and then two teaspoons of cumin. And I know, I don't, you know, just that seems like a lot, but remember, I do two pounds, and so this is premixed for how much I make. And it is it, for my family, for our taste buds, this. Um, Ratio of spices is a perfectly balanced seasoning for us. It all tastes great together how it is. If you need to make less, if you're somebody that only needs to prepare about a pound of meat, you know, you need to reduce this by half. And if you need more, then, you know, you can double it. Um, but there it is. Easy peasy. And you won't miss that package. All right, guys. Well, that was it. I mean... It's just six spices, six pantry staple spices, that if you cook, I'm 98% sure you've got all those spices in your pantry right now. Um, so give a homemade version a try and see if it works for you. Uh, or use it as a base and you can uh, tweak it any way you like it. If you like a little bit of Mexican oregano, you could add some of that in here, a teaspoon or two. Uh, if you like cayenne for a little extra spice, you can put some of that. Um, I don't add those into mine because they're just, my kids don't like those flavors and so we leave those out. But you can use this as a base and make it your own and let me know how it works for you. And thank you again to those of you who are subscribed. If you're visiting me today, uh, please hit that subscribe button below and do hit that notification bell. And you'll get a notification every single time I manage to get a new video uploaded on YouTube. And I would love to have you here as part of my YouTube family. Thank you guys. Uh, thank you again for watching and y'all have a wonderful evening. Have a wonderful Taco Tuesday. I'll see you again in another video really soon.